May there be well-being for all. May there be peace for all. May there be wholeness for all. May there be happiness for all. Um. How about I join you for some downward doggy style? How was work? 71 Chevelle rebuild. Sweet bitch. Cool. Is that how you spent your day? It's one in a new series I'm starting. Oh. Looks like a thing exploded. I'm gonna need new paints. Yeah, you know, these shorts get me every time. We should uh, clean up and get ready for the party. Uh, I don't wanna be dirty. I wanna shower. Mom, we got hours before the party. No, it's not a good time. It's a good time for me. Do you want to shower first? Yeah, whatever. If we get to my uncle's party early, we can say hi to my cousins and then leave. He's even going to pay for our ride. Whatever. Shane, please don't be like... Whatever! Go take your shower! If you want to shower with me, I'll make sure you get clean. Hell yeah. Going back to school? I want to finish my degree. For what? Drawing pictures? To get more options? Who's gonna pay for it? My scholarship is still good. Nothing's free. It's bullshit, you're hiding this from me. I wasn't hiding it. <laughs> you're so much smarter than me, huh? The world is freaking candy land. Let's talk about this later. No. No, we're not going to your uncle's party, all right? That broken ass family of yours? That's what you should want to run away from, not me. I'm not trying to, no. <gasps> Get out. I live here, all right? I'm not going anywhere. Lou? Trick or treat. Um, I'm a driver for CART. I'm here for Lulu. Are, are you Lulu?
Nice costume. Thanks. What are you supposed to be? Little Red Riding Hood. Oh, food for Grandma's house. I get it. Nice, nice. You're uh, probably going to a party or something, huh? Yeah. I wish I was. <laughs> Had to drive all night. So, uh, where's your wolf? No wolf. Oh, yeah? That's too bad. Look kind of sad. Everything okay? I'm okay. You sure? I'm not really doing my job if you're not smiling, <laughs> you know? Why don't you give me a little smile? Just, just a little one. Come on. Just, just like a little smile. Just turn that frown upside down. Yeah. I have such beautiful lips. <laughs> wow. Puff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. <laughs> All right. Your daughter has something she'd like to ask you. Oh, see, my daughter is definitely your daughter. Yes, but see, I was never this ornery. Mm. Sweetheart, uh, your mom says you have something to ask me? Do you remember how you suggested we build a tree house? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How about an underground bunker, a fallout shelter instead? Um, and why? Why would we need a fallout shelter? 
It'd be way better than a treehouse if a terrorist attacks it off grid, destroying nukes. War would if bacteria infested meteorite hits Earth and triggers a pandemic of zombies. Yes, honey. I mean, think about it. A bunker does sound like a very practical idea. A, a, a pan, pan, pandemic, pandemic. Of zombieism, huh? A good survival is prepared for every given scenario, real or imagined. Hmm, what she said. Mm hmm. Oh, see, I imagine we don't need a fallout shelter. I think we're fine. I'll drop the blueprints for you to look over. You see that? She didn't even, just like, didn't really. No, no. Just kind of right over me. Yeah. And like, just. That's you your daughter. That really? Your daughter. No, yours. Okay. All right. Just, you know, let's get cracking on those. We're going to look at those planes. How about that? You need help. You obviously need help. I mean, look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you. I'm, I'm gonna help you. Hey, look, I'm gonna call the police. You just have to tell me what happened. They. They. Hello, oh, hello. Oh, oh. You need to sit back. No, no, no. It's okay. I got it. Relax. God damn it. May I help you? Yeah, we were in a really bad accident just up the road, and and my sister, she she's autistic amongst other things, and she hit her head and she took off her and I. From the way uh, she took off, I, th I thought maybe she'd come through here. Have you seen her? Have you called the police? Yeah, yeah, we have. We said it would take a while, and you know, I just couldn't wait around, you know? Uh, do you, you have a cabin in the area? Yeah, uh, uh, our friend does. Do I know him? Uh, it's pretty far. You know, you two seem to be all right for being in an accident. <laughs> It's weird how that happens sometimes, right? Yeah. Maybe come in. You know what? I'll, I'm gonna give the police a ring for you. And, uh, I also have a buddy that's a forest ranger. They do a good job out here. Thank you. That's. I appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm really thirsty. You mind if I just come in for a glass of water? I'll bring one out to you. Wait here. No problem. Call the police. They're on the way. And no offense, I'd like you to leave my property. You can wait at the end of the driveway. May I give my glass of water? Here's a gun. Oh. Well, that's very observant. I'm also black with a really nice cabin in the woods. We won't take any more of your time, okay? Come on, baby. Please don't shoot us.
try not to. Hey, if you're in the bathroom, you can come out. I'm going to the police. Are those, uh, those men hunting you? I took a cart to my uncle's Halloween party and... Cart? You mean like a golf cart? It's, it's, it's a phone app. Like, you call someone and they, they pick you up in their car like a taxi. Wait, those men are taxi drivers? Oh, uh, no, the driver, he, he was touching himself. Well, touching himself? Is he one of them? I, I don't know. He was, he was in a clown costume and he picked me up and he said that we had to go pick up another passenger. He was out of the way and when we got there, that's when they attacked me. You're bleeding. <laughs> he, he got me all over. What? Okay, and you and you and you've got a limp. Oh, I um, twisted my ankle when I was running. Okay, now look at it. Look, you can sit on the bed. Listen, don't worry. I'm not gonna hurt you. Oh, I I, I don't want to make a mess. No, no, it, it's okay. It's okay. to this ankle, but we need to hurry. Um, I'm gonna get you a washcloth. You may not want to shower if there's a, if there's evidence. This, this isn't my shirt, I don't want it. Okay, I'm just gonna go right in here, okay? I think you and my wife were the same size. We gotta get out of here. Neil! We gotta go. You let her go on purpose, didn't you? <laughs> no. You got some kind of sicko fantasy about the two of you running off and living happily ever after, huh, you fucking pervert? Maybe he's right. Maybe we should just go. Go? Where are we gonna go, Snack? Huh? You want me back in the penitentiary? No. This wasn't part of the deal. No, the deal is you finish what you started and we clean up the evidence. That's the deal. Oh, come on, man. We don't even know if she's in there. She's in there. He said he called the cops. Cut the phone line. Oh, he cut the phone line. Well, maybe he called another way, huh? Well, there's still time to tidy up. Mm -mm. No, no, it's too risky. <sighs> Did you use a condom when you fucked her, Chad? Baby, baby, go get my pistol out the back of the truck. We'll see what this guy's made of. Come in, please. Keep your eyes open and your mouth closed. They'll be coming out soon. Well, when they finally come out, don't shoot Lou. Just make sure I don't shoot you. Shh. I hear something. I don't see them. Now's our chance. Stay back, okay? Shot at us! 
you you have guns you were in the military you can fight them off i have this gun it is fairly new and no military i was a i was a floor manager at a brick plant uh, a brick plant we made bricks mostly i took early retirement okay i'm joe troy's it lulu lulu okay so lulu it's a far walk from town they cut the only landline to this house and i'm running out of bullets in this gun okay uh what are we gonna do i'm trying not to faint i don't feel so good no listen it's not okay. over i've got more bullets in the bedroom okay come on okay I think I've been shot. What? It burns. Uh, uh, let me see it. Oh, shit. Oh, baby. It grazed right through, baby. That's bad. Mm -hmm. She should go to a hospital. I dig chicks with scars. Uh, you guys are sick. You're getting off on this. Uh, you disgust me, pussy. I think I saw a first aid kit in Chad's car. I can banish this up. Oh, it's starting to numb already. I'll keep an eye on the cabin. Go with her. Yeah, go. And bring back that gas can. I'll give diplomacy one more chance. We should figure out how we're gonna get you to town. I have a feeling that's the last we're gonna see of them. I got up today and I didn't even tune in on the news. I didn't bother to catch on to whatever cancers in the chemtrails or uh, crazy lizard people conspiracies. <laughs> Shit. I left my phone behind. But it was peaceful. And it started out as one of the best days. I've had it in a very long time. I'm sorry. Um, all I have is is uh, cold bacon. Please, please have some. Oh no, I'm a, I'm a vegetarian. Well, well, hold on. You need your strength. You know, and other animals they eat meat, so. I feel that humans have taken on the responsibility of a higher spiritual consciousness, and eating animals as food is unnecessary. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you know what I also heard? I heard that plants communicate with each other when they're in danger. You know, like, ah. I won't judge you for eating bacon if you don't judge me for eating plants. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Uh, here. Bread is vegetarian. Hmm? We really shouldn't be here if he called the cops. He wouldn't try to make a run for it if he had called the cops. This isn't what I wanted. I thought it would be a, like a, a double date. Well, what does your wife think about this? Maybe you could invite her and the kids along. Neil does not know how to treat a woman. For God's sakes, he calls you a snack. Yeah, well, I'm his jelly bean and he's my gummy bear. He's wrong. You've been shot. You need to see a doctor. So, you think that me and you, we should just jump in the car and, and, and take off? You could convince him, Snack. You could convince him. Neil protected your ass in prison. I paid. Yeah, well, you may be able to betray your family, Chatty Chad, but you're not going to convince me to betray mine. Got it? Yeah. Now, 
The good thing about living out one fantasy in your head is it makes room for a new one. Let's go play. Hey, cabin boy! Let me know you can hear me! Hey, look, I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Ain't nobody coming for you, man. Ain't no phones out here. Can't nobody hear you. You're not getting out of this fucking place. You understand? What do you want, huh? Why are you protecting that bitch? She's ours. We're both men, right? So let's deal like men. How about a 10% finder's fee, huh? You found her fair and square. I get that. I'll even throw in a little extra for the truck. Look, you don't know me and I don't know you, okay? I know you don't know what we're capable of. Just let the girl go. Give her to us and you can stay here and everything will be fine. Last warning. You come any closer and I will shoot you. I will burn this place to the fucking ground. That's what you want. Okay. Then you all die here. Nobody gets out. You hear me? Nobody. God damn it. Fuck. How'd you know he wouldn't shoot you? Normal people don't shoot people in cold blood, baby. Mm. What makes you think that man's normal? He didn't shoot me. He might now if we try to rush him again, though. We'll wait him out, let him stress and crack. How long? We'll wait until dark, then we'll go in and get him. No. We got a lot of hours before it's dark. You are just giving that man time to fortify his defenses. I'm done giving him clear targets. You want Snack to take another bullet for you, fat boy? Don't have to be so hurtful, Neil. Just stressed. I'm retaining water. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry I didn't shoot him when I had the chance. This is all my fault. God, don't say that. We need a plan. Uh... I mean, they make sure the windows and the doors are locked. Look, do you know how to use a gun? No. Okay, so let me show you. See, the bullets in this gun are the only ones left. I can't. It's simple. No, I can never use a gun. Look, they have guns. This is our answer for that. Please don't make me. You may have to. Look, it's, it's just like my daughter used to say, okay, she, uh, she'd say, Dad, I won't always be here to protect you. So you gotta use the... Oh. Holy shit. Lulu, what do you know about the zombie apocalypse? I don't. It's the, um, the undead. And they, they roam the earth and they, they feed off the brains of the living. Oh, okay, so anyway, my, my daughter, she made it her hobby to prepare for the zombie apocalypse. So if, if zombies ever attacked this cabin, she would have defensive measures. Okay, um, look, we might as well, we might as well go crazy, right? Might as well go all out. Let's start with the locks and doors.
Hey, you okay in there? <laughs> Lulu? Fine, I'm fine. Okay, uh, if you need any aspirin, it's in there. And I'll I'll just stay out here in case you need me. Once was a girl with eyes of dream. I cut her throat to stop her scream. Pain of little death it begs. Tongue to lick between her legs. To taste the pulse of memory. To make her come inside of me. Come, come inside of me. You knew what I was about when you invited me to party. Why are you still pouting? It's a waste, is all. We go move her into your cabin, visit her on the weekends. I was grooming her trust for a long time. She was supposed to be my little pet. You don't want pets. You want treats. You eat them and throw away the wrapper. Is that what you're doing with Snack? It's the only woman I let hold my knife. She's my ride or die. It's different. <laughs> Does she got a sister? I'll let you fuck the girl one more time. Then you get rid of her. And if I don't, you're gonna kill me? I'm gonna kill you if you don't. What if I make a trade? What? You make my wife and kids disappear. What's that worth? My wife has a fat bank account. We can talk about that on down the road. Oh, you could run her off the road, make it look like an accident. And a fire, a boating accident. You're creative, you could do it. Hey, baby, what do you think? You wanna kill some women and children? The night it comes to steal the day lets the monsters out to play. La dee da dee da. Sing it for me, baby. I don't get it. Is that a yes or a no? Hey, it's, a, it's my daughter's toy box. And in it, there is a notebook of her plan somewhere in here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, now this. She made this because I wouldn't buy her an axe. <laughs> okay. Mm. The pictures around the house, that's your daughter? Uh, yeah, that's uh, Sophia. You, uh, you actually remind me a lot of her. You're, um, you're very brave. No, I'm not. I'm gonna do what I can to get you back to your family. There's not much more of that. My mom and I aren't close. My dad was killed in prison. He and my uncle had some sort of embezzling scheme or something. 
When my uncle got out, he promised he would take care of me. I spent a lot of time with him and my cousins. Look, family isn't always perfect, but you got to hold on to what you got. My uncle, Chad, he, uh, he's one of those men out there. It was his Halloween party I was supposed to go to. So we must have sent that driver. They kept me tied up and blindfolded most of the time, but I could hear voices. I'm sure it was him. He raped me. Now they know we're still out here. Gotta keep their nerves itching. <laughs> Gave me a boner. Mm, I love you with God. <laughs> They're toying with us. I should go out there and hunt them down. No, please don't leave me. Zombie defenses. It just seems so silly now. You're doing the best you can. I mean, maybe we can wait them out. Only problem is, they aren't zombies. They're vampires. You have to invite them in. We need to make it seem like it's their idea where to come inside. I'm gonna take a piss. Shake it more than twice, you're playing with it. Yeah, keep my shit. You know, if you wanna cut me, sometimes you can. Well, somebody's crazy. <sighs> Inconsiderate motherfuckers. I got better shit to do than standing in these fucking woods. What are you smiling about? Where's the pervert? Chad! Chadwick! Where'd the pervert go? Are you gonna cry now? Are you gonna cry, little baby? And then stay here and watch the house. Oh, God damn. Fuck.
Where are you going, huh? Hey! Neil? Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? Hey! Neil! I'm so glad to see you, man. I, I got lost. I thought maybe, you know, you were hungry. We could get some hot dogs and eat them. You gonna go back to your cabin in your car? Cheat me out of my money? No, no, no. Uh, so what you gonna do, huh? Huh? You think you're just gonna run off, leave me to clean it up? Huh? Where are you going now, huh? Where are you going now, huh? Yeah. You yeah. like that? Yeah. Huh? You think you're smarter than me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, listen. Is that what you think? Oh. Yeah. This is, up. this is where you die, right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah listen. I don't want to kill her. What? I don't want to kill her. You have to kill her. She's family. What are you talking about? She's family. What the fuck are you talking about? Family? What do you mean she's family? She's my niece. What? She's my niece. She's your niece? Yeah. She knows who you are? She's my niece. What are you talking about? Oh, you dirty old man. No, oh, you love her. You don't love anybody. You piece of shit! <laughs> Get on your feet! I got a plan! Get on your feet! I got a plan! Empty your pockets. Dude, I got a plan! What are you talking about? Just get the gun away from my face. I'll tell you I got a plan. What? Just listen. What? These are your last words. So say them very carefully. Okay. Shane. Who's Shane? Her boyfriend. She does everything he says. She will come out of the cabin for him. I guarantee it. Just please be easy peasy Japanese. So she stopped pointing the fucking gun at me. Please, please. Uh, he's lying again. No, 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 no I wouldn't lie to you. Again. No, no, stop. Oh, dude. Jesus. Oh, stop. Yeah. Stop it. Please, please. No, please. come on. Please. That's it. Get up. Please. No. I'm your right. Empty your pockets. I, Empty your pockets. I Take out your ID. I Put it on the ground right there. Get out of the suit. No. Take off your clothes. I can't. I want to take off the clothes. Take off your clothes you right now. Neil, it's not necessary. I'm your right or die, buddy. Uh, fuck. Jesus. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, fuck. All right. Yeah, all right. It's coming. Okay. Get off with the pants. No. Take them off. No. Now. No. Okay. All right. I'll put the cover on. Pants are coming off. We gotta finish what we started, right? We can do it. If you like, the don't fucking don't pants fucking, off now. Okay. Okay. Put the fucking gun down. Okay. Ah. Okay. Ah. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. I got yeah. Oh, God damn it. You want to act like a little bitch, huh? No, 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 no. Is that what you want to do? Fun. You want to act like a little bitch? Because I said so, that's why. <laughs> you're going to lie to me, huh? No, you think you're going to trick me again, huh? I would never, Is that what you think? I would never you lie bitch? to you. You think that's what you're going to do, huh? No, no, no. What are you doing? No, 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 no. You're going to get the boy. No. And you're gonna get my fucking money. Okay. Man, you understand? Oh, 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 oh. You understand now, huh? How do you like that bitch? No. Oh, you wanna be punked? No. You wanna be like a fucking punk? No. Huh? Come on, stand. Okay, the uh, carpet is there to cover the pressure plate. See, Sophia's mother was an engineer, and then she became a teacher. Um, um, Nadine. She, uh, she, uh, I'm going back to college to finish my art degree. I don't know what careers I might explore. I just, I know I've been living at a dead end for far too long. Oh, what, what kind of art? Oh, I paint, um, abstract mostly. Oh. Uh, um. Um, I'm proud of you. You don't even really know me. Yeah, well, I know something. 
I know that you were drunk in hell and pulled yourself out. I've got goals, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> it's all set. You actually got a signal? One bar. He's gonna GPS his way over here. Man can't even disappear in the middle of nowhere anymore. Well, let's go tell Snack what you're up to. If this doesn't work, then barrel up your butt's gonna be the highlight of your day. Come on, let's go. Make right, it snappy. Right. Let's go. Who's that guy? I told you about him. He's the man who owns the cabin. Explain all that again. Kid, whatever fight you had with my niece, it threw her over the edge. I told her she could come stay with us, no problem. But next thing I know, she's raiding the medicine cabinet, having who knows what coming to the house delivering things. Who doesn't do drugs? Pills, man. Everybody does pills. I know about you. You probably slept or something. Kid, this is not fuck around time. She stole a car. She crashed it. Then she broke into that guy's cabin, and now she's holed up in there with some guy, and they're acting crazy and suicidal. Some guy? I don't know. Her, her drug dealer, probably. We need you to get her to come out to us. Take me to her. Go on up ahead. I'll be right behind you. OK, we got company. Do you recognize them? I I'm not sure. Your show, you go with him. What? Just come on. It's your uncle. I'm here with Shane. We heard you were in trouble. We want to help. Lou! It's Shane. Look, they're telling me some crazy stories out here. If they're in there, talk to me. Who is that? It's my boyfriend, Shane. Wait a minute. Is he working with your no, uncle? No, he wouldn't. Baby, I love you. I really messed up this time, I know. Will you please just talk to me? We talked to the police. I'm gonna make it all better, baby. He could get us out of here. No, it's a trap. I hurt you. I never meant to hurt you, but I did. The way I've been acting, I, I can fix all that. You should feel appreciated. 
you'll just give me a chance. I just want to get you home safe. Look, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Let's get back in the house. Come on, come on. This is stupid. I'm just gonna go in and get her. No. Don't. Oh, fuck. The hell is your problem? Tell him to come out of the cabin, or I'll shoot the boyfriend. Lou, they're going to shoot me. Hey, kid, come over here. Who are you? You move, you're dead. Move, and you're dead. I'll go out there. No, no, no. We'll kill you both. You have five seconds until I shoot this kid. You got five seconds before they shoot the kid. Please, we have to do something. OK, OK. Shane! Shane, run over to me! Come on! I don't have a shot! Shane, run! They're gonna kill me because of you. You selfish, useless perk. Don't hurt Lou. It's too late for that. You hurt her. How long have you known her? I loved her since she was a child. Get your hands off of there. You don't get to move in on her. Ruin her life. Ruin everybody's life! You shit! You shit! You shit! Get in the back seat, Chad. Get the gas tank, Chad. Take the pants off, Chad! soon. Hey, 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 look, look, just, just calm down, all right? You're here, you're safe. I'm here with you. Just let me go back and check on Shane. Okay, we have four bodies, all the vehicles, and both cabins to burn. Can we keep one of the cabins? No. Anything the perv touched, dead weight, just like him. We should have went and bought gas. I told you to get gas. Hey, guys. Where's the boyfriend? Ah, oh, I took care of that. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that. The three of us are going to that cabin right now, finishing this job. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Is he dead? Yes. I'm sorry. I tried to. I tried to. Hey, breathe. Please, breathe, breathe, breathe. Stay with me, please. Lulu, stay with me. Yeah, we'll mourn him. We can survive this. 
We're more than one we survive this. I need you to just calm down, okay? Thing. Keep your voice down, you idiot! Look, look, I can hear better out there, all right? So, I'll be right outside the door. No, no, listen, listen, listen. You stay here until I give you okay. You scream. You scream if you need me, all right? I'll be right out here.
Are you okay? I'm okay. We're fucked over. I gotta go to the hospital. Where is Neil? He's inside. We're going back in. You got an arrow in your arm. No. Really? I, hold on. I got an idea. Here we, here we go. Here. What are you doing? I'm gonna snip, snip. You dumb fuck! No, 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 that's gonna hurt. I can take it. I birthed two kids. Now quit being a sniveling dick, Chad, and grow yourself a pussy! I'm out, all right? So, get ready to plunge. Do what I say, or I'll slit you open. Motherfucker, you're gonna pay. Motherfucker, you're gonna pay. Let's sit down on the couch. Get over there, sit down. Let me kill this one. No, 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 don't, don't, don't. Look, look, you let her go. I'll pay you. She's already spoken for, but I'll hear your offer. Where's Uncle Chad? It's outside. I love this song. Reminds me of good times. I see you. Get in here. What makes you so special, huh? Why does everybody care so much? Why are they so in love with you, huh? Why are you so special? They're gonna pay. How much? How much, huh? A hundred grand! A hundred grand? What are you, the mountain man of Wall Street, huh? You some kind of rapper or something? <laughs> Lulu. My 
little strawberry. It's your, it's your Uncle Chad. You're safe now. Put her on the couch. Sit her down. Get over here. Sit down. Give me my knife. It's mine. Give me. Look. Look. They're gonna kill us no matter what. Okay? Shut the fuck up! His offer's better than yours. So I'll make you a deal. You two, you fight to the death. And whoever wins gets to fuck the girl one last time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no more boy games. I'm gonna have scars. And if I have to remember this, then I want my fucking cake. Get over here! Yeah, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Come here. Move! She came crying to her uncle's party. <laughs> My man, he tried to show me his teepee. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. <laughs> Yeah. 
because I wouldn't take work off to get here this same day. You're all alone. Sophia. Oh, Sophia, she couldn't wait for help. Carried her mother out of the cabin and tried to try to drive her to the hospital. good man. We are fighters. And you and I, we have to live today, so you have got to get up because we have got to go, okay? You have to get up! We need to get to a hospital. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Is, is it bad? It's bad. I probably shouldn't have taken that out. Help me out, please. Oh, yeah. We'll help you. Oh, my God. 
might still be alive. I'll take care. There for me, Uncle Chad. Always watching over me. You were. You gotta help me. You won't hurt me ever again. <laughs> You're so brave, Sophia. You're so brave yourself. You're so. Wake up, Dylan. You have to stay with me. Dylan, wake up. Dylan, stay with me. Dylan, wake up. Dylan, stay with me. Dylan, wake up. Stay with me! First time anybody's ordered a veggie bacon sandwich on my shift. Is it any good? Don't know. First time ordering it. More meat and potatoes kind of gal. I get bloody and juicy. <laughs> I'm trying new things. Baby steps. Hey, Gina. Gina. This coffee's getting cold. You gonna sit there and blah, blah all day? You gonna come and fill me up? You got something to say? Yeah. Why don't you give her a motherfucking awesome tip, you shitbird?